So we're gonna come in, we're gonna have some fun. We're, we're, we're gonna laugh, we're gonna joke, and we're gonna talk about business, we're gonna talk about life, we're gonna talk about effort, we're gonna talk about average. We're gonna talk about some things that hopefully are gonna, sh gonna shift the way you think. But the first thing I wanna do, because you guys just ate, and I already know, so we're gonna do an exercise, but not a, yeah, we're gonna, I wanna break up into some groups and I wanna um, just do something a little different for you guys. So this is how many? One, two, three, four, five. So these two tables, six. I told you. Lesson number one, learn how to count. Right? So we got one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. And this is six and four is ten. And that's three. Break up into two groups. Come on, let's break up. Break up into two groups. As a group, I'm going to give you a product or a service for you as a group to deliver and pitch. Everybody in the group has to have a part of the presentation. Everybody has to speak. Everybody has to do a part of the pitch. Three minutes to do the pitch. The product or service that you get is not gonna be easy. You guys are gonna have to pick a leader. You're gonna have to work together. You're gonna have to argue and fight. You're gonna have to, oh, no, no maybe don't do that. But I'm gonna give you this, and I want you guys to pitch the product and sell the product. Are you guys ready? We're going to take five minutes, that 10, because we're a little larger group, seven minutes for you guys to put the pitch together, right? You will be judged. There will be a winner, and there will be a loser. Okay, question, question, question. As you guys were in your groups, what was the very first thing that you knew you had to do as a team? What was the first thing you knew you had to do? Work together, participate, what else? You had to have a theme, what else? There was one thing that you guys did. You told us to find a leader. Right, now, the leader, did they volunteer or was it an organic thing? Who was the leader over here? Kendall was a leader. Who was the leader? Exactly. Who was the leader over here? Tom. Now, did he say I'm the leader? No, he nope. came up with the jingle and Last we made the leader. Last thing. Did he say I'm the leader? No. He just took charge. How would it have gone if you did not have a leader? Chaos. It would have been chaos, right? Same thing in your businesses, in your, in your jobs even at your house. Somebody got to be the boss. I try to tell my wife this all the time. <laughs> oh, no, I'm serious. Like, somebody got to be the boss. You say, okay, I am. So you find a leader, you work as a team, and then you found out who was really sweet with what they did. Like, in every group, there's somebody that really thinks that they're, they're really good at what they do. And you had to find people in the group that were good, like that could, that could dance the jingle or put the, and do whatever. And everybody's talent came out. But you do it at work. You do it at home. You see your kids sometimes, I mean, you've got kids. Children, how many got children still at the house that you want to leave? <laughs> so you do it at home, yeah. <laughs> you do it at home and you don't even know that you're doing it. And this, I do this exercise because of two things. First of all, I love it because we're having fun. But the other thing is you need to see the leader. You need to see what it, how to work together as a team. We ain't just talking about business. We're not just talking about work and teams at work. What you do at home carries over into work. I tell people if your personal life is a mess, every other part of your life is gonna be a mess. 